Hi Scorpio, it's Lynn from Tinker Tarot. I'm here to do your mid-October 2019 reading. I'm using the regular playing cards in this reading. I have Van Gogh, Starry Night. Very nice, eh? Um, so, I also have tarot readings. Um, videos, so if you prefer that, I have an October one out, and I'll be putting another one out in a few days. Um, ooh, we have a flipper. The Four of Hearts. This is the underlying energy. This is a nice gathering. This is something that you go, it's a group of people. It could be a concert, it could be a party, it could be a wedding, you know, anything like that. So, you know, this is important because it jumped right out. So, let's see what we got for you, Scorpio. I'm going to cut them. Da -da -da -da. And I want, kind of wanted you to see how I do this um, to have a view of the layout a little bit. I know the lighting's not the greatest, but... So when I lay them out, I lay them out first down, uh, face down, and I turn them over, the piles over as I get to them, okay? So, just about done. What do we have at the bottom of the pile? The Queen of Hearts. So you are meeting the Queen of Hearts at this gathering here, okay? This is a blue-eyed woman. Um, it could be a man too, but I always call it first as it as it's represented. Um, so more than likely a woman. Um, that also could be you, Scorpio. You could be this blue-eyed woman. But anyway, this person's important. You're going to meet them at this nice gathering. Um, yeah. So whoa, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> So, um, this is, uh, you know, where you are now. And you have the Ten of Hearts, the Two of Diamonds, and the Jack of Hearts. Um, this is Cupid, you know, uh, flooring you, basically. You being floored at this meeting. And this is a passionate meeting. This is like you hit... You're being hit by Cupid. <laughs> oh, wow, Scorpio. Um, yeah, this is um, pretty strong. You're feeling all youthful again, you know, like butterflies in your stomach and um, just can't, you know. Uh, and and you're and I think you're getting the same thing back from this person. Like there's electricity, you know. I can feel it. There's electricity here. Okay, just coming in is the nine of clubs, the six of diamonds, and the seven of spades. So this is the job site. You're trying to. I think you're. I think you were hoping to get a promotion or to go up a level um, financially to, to get into a better paying position. Um, but I, I, I see tears. Now, they could be tears of joy because they're beside the Six of Diamonds. So perhaps you're, you know, crying. You're really happy you got this promotion. You know what I mean? Um, there's no negative cards here to suggest it's disappointment. I think it's tears of happiness. Even the the six diamonds falling like look like tears doo -doo 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 coming down, eh? Yeah, they're like diamonds, like a diamond. So on your mind is the ten of clubs, the four of spades, and the ace of diamonds. Um, I think you're moving. Jeez, it seems like everyone's moving. I think you're moving. Um, it could be jobs. Like I said, you could have gotten a promotion or a better paying position or something, a level up perhaps. Now, this could be the new job, 
but there you're there's something you're doubtful hmm. I think something you heard or read is causing doubt in your own capabilities and it, I don't don't let that stuff get in your head you know don't let things you've read or heard cause doubt in you and your capabilities it's kind of saying something you heard or read or something is you're kind of thinking oh sh shoot can I handle this you know I almost said the the other word <laughs> myself though just in the nick of time so this is your work and accomplishments pile over here and you have the king of diamonds the ten of diamonds and the six of hearts this is really nice um, the king of diamonds I always see him as an older man um, he could have green eyes maybe gray I just saw gray um, or um, like blue, real light blue. Um, he probably has gray hair, white hair, uh, starting to go gray. He's mature. I see this guy as mature, okay? Um, could be your boss, even, you know? And it looks like... Um, like the six of hearts is a nice trip you could be going on vacation you could be getting uh, a trip as a reward or something of some sort you could be uh, a f for your work you could be going um it, it kind of looks like a romantic trip maybe you're giving it or getting it as a gift from your person and you know it's kind of right in line with this queen and jack pile like this hidden by cupid it's right in line with it you might go on a trip with this person okay um they could be older than you too they could be older than you like this king of diamonds could be you scorpio this queen of hearts could be you you have to decide who you are in this story, okay? Um, so this is your influences. <laughs> Seven of hearts, two of hearts, three of hearts. Like, you operate by your feelings, how you feel about something. And you're feeling the love, you know? You're feeling the love. You're feeling passion. Um, this person, they can only think about you and you can only think about them like you guys are really um uh like you're really doing well all around things are going your way okay um so you're all like uh lovey dovey it seems like to me all right in the foundation there is some sort of ending okay and in this ending there it's like you win some you lose some all right in this ending whatever this was this could be um it could be um relationship a relationship that has ended because this is new this stuff this cupid and this all this stuff this is all knew this is could be something that ended in the past but it's with this ending um you win some you lose some okay that this has already happened okay um and then this is your surprise pile over here and you you don't expect it okay even though i'm telling you so two of spades three of clubs and jack of clubs so um this is a breakup this is a breakup okay and it's something you've worked hard on it's a friendship that you've worked hard on you know 
um, and it's it's going to break up this hasn't happened and you don't expect this um, but it's a uh, the because this is breakup going your separate ways okay and of a relationship that you've worked hard you have put a lot of work in maybe the other person's put work in too you know um, but uh, it could be because of a third party all right it could be because of a third party so wow lots happening for you kind of a little bit of a mixture here but mostly really good for you Scorpio you know some sort of a raise or promotion or doing something different or doing something worth that gets you more money at work you're very happy um, and then like I said I think you're going on a trip or something like that the only real negative stuff is um, this I feel like it's gossip or something like that you know in some way might be bothering you um, and then this ending you win some you lose some it doesn't look so bad this could be a breakup here a past breakup and um, and then the this breakup it, it's like a friendship though this isn't love this isn't passion I think this is a friendship and it's going to surprise you, really surprise you. All right, Scorpio. So I hope somewhere in here there was a message for you that can help you on your path. Um, if there was, if you resonate or like this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. It really helps me, and it's free. Um, and, oh, uh, of course, comment in the box below. I'd really like to hear if this resonates and how I read all the comments. Thank you very much, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye now.